Hi, boys and girls. Welcome back to our last language arts lesson this week. Today is Friday, and starting next week, Mrs. Troutman will be doing reading and language arts, and I will be doing math. And we're going to go back and forth, doing a week at a time, so that you guys are getting to see both teachers teach, which is awesome, and getting ready, you guys ready for first grade. It is so fun being able to teach you guys, and I just love seeing your faces in our meetings and getting to see how much you guys have learned. Today, we are going to be reviewing all of the special sounds that we've learned this week. You guys remember yesterday I showed you that we have learned six and we added two more. So if we add two more to six, we learned eight special sounds this week. And that is a lot of special sounds and that is a lot more words that you guys are gonna be able to read and spell and write. It's just amazing how much you guys have been learning. I'm so proud of each and every one of you. I love all of you so much. To start off today, we are going to just do a little bit of a review from our blends and then we will review our special sounds and have a fun little thing for us to do for to review the special sounds. First off, with our blends, we're going to be doing long vowels and short vowel blends. Think, okay, short vowel blends. What sound, kind of sound do they say? Who knows? I said it in the name. Good, they should say they're short sound. So, a, a, i, e, and a. And then the long vowel blends, they say they're long sound. Remember, we can stretch those sounds out so you can hear it better. And they say their name, a, e, i, o, and u. Okay? Now, these first ones, hope you guys are ready. If you have a J in your name, I want you to say this one, okay? Ready? Good, this is the blend net. Everybody rub your neck. Oh man, sometimes we need to massage it and stretch it. So when we look down for too long or look up for too long, our necks can get sore. Now, if you, have a T in your name. T, -t, -t, -t. I want you to say this one. Pay attention to the symbol above the vowel. Good, this is Xi. There aren't a whole lot of words that have the Xi special sound. Next, if you have an O in your name, I want you to repeat this one. Good, this is the blend they. And I want you guys to think, hmm, what when mommy gets flowers or grandma gets flowers maybe you get flowers anybody in your family gets flowers what do they put those flowers in that's right they put them in a vase and vase has this blend good if you have a v in your name remember first or last name which there are a lot of these i bet they have all of these letters read this one please Good, this is the blend ma. And when that floor gets really dirty, mama, mom or dad, whoever it cleans, has swept it. They do something else over it. Gets it wet and really clean. Who knows? Good, they mop it. The last one. This is a special sound, very important for me. And I wonder if you guys can figure out why, okay? I want everybody to say this one out loud, okay? Yeah, this way, sorry. Good, this is the blend Jew. And I don't know if you guys know this, but that blend Jew is in my name. Not Miss Harper, but the name that uh, my mom and my dad call me and some of my friends call me, they call me Julie Ann and it's got the Jew in it. So that's why that special sound is important to me because it's in my name. Okay, enough of those blends. Why did I call this a special sound? It's a blend. Sometimes even I get tricked by what I'm talking about. We've done learn so much. Now, I did tell you guys that we were going to do a little activity with our special sounds, and we are. 
first I want to review them and go over all of them to see, make sure you guys remember the motions and then we will do a little fun game. Okay, so I'm going to shuffle these up and then you're just going to tell me the little sentence that we do, okay? To make sure that we know what they are. And don't forget to do those motions. Okay, ready? S L sleep in sleep. Ah, sleep is so good, guys. S P sp in spay. Dig that hole. Awesome. S K sk in skate. Skating is so fun. S C sk in scat. Scat that cat away. It wants to scratch you. T W tw in twins. C R cr in crab. S M sm in smoke. Get it away, smelly. S in sn in snack. Good job. I hope you guys remember to practice those yesterday after we learned the last two for the week. I hope you've been practicing every day because they are so important. Now, what you guys have been waiting for, we are going to do a fun little activity. And in this activity, you guys actually need room to, to move around. So you're sitting in a chair. I want you guys to stand up, okay? and spread out, find somewhere in your house where there's nothing that you're gonna knock over, okay? Okay, you guys ready? You're in a spot where you can still hear me, you can still see me, and you're not gonna hit anything or break anything. Awesome. Now, I've found some action words that are, have our special sounds in them, and an action word it means you're doing something. It's also called a verb. And so, an action, is whenever I smile, or whenever I play with my hair, or shoot a basketball. Those are all actions. Play and shoot and smile. And I have found some words that have our special sounds that we've learned this week. I'm gonna tell you an action that I want you to do, and then I want you to think, what special sounds in that word that we learned this week, okay? And you are going to tell me what special sound it is, okay? Does that sound like fun? I hope it does. So, I will tell you the correct special sound after you guys have had time to do the action, okay? So our first one, I've got my list of words over next to me, so that's why I've got to be written down. I want you guys, to pretend, some of these things you're gonna have to pretend because you might not have it with you. And I don't want you to run off to go get it, but you're gonna have to pretend. I want you guys to pretend, want you guys to smell. Can you guys smell? <laughs> smell, smell, smell. You guys are doing this action, right? And now think, hmm, what special sound is in the word smell and i want you guys to go kim do i know it you guys got it say it out loud let's see if what she said matches it the sm in smoke is in the word smell okay now i want you guys i want you guys to Cry. No, it's so sad. <laughs> Are you crying? I hope so. Now think. What special sound that we learned this week has this has does cry have in it? Okay, there are some words that they might have a special sound that we learned a long time ago. But the new ones that we learned this week, just think, hmm. I want you guys to think which special sound is it? Which one of these two special sounds? So, that's right, it is that is it. Now, 
I want you guys to pretend you are outside. You are walking your dog and they went potty. And now you are going to scoop up what they potty. I know it sounds really silly, but remember when you do that, you have a bag on your hand and it's, you're not doing that. Maybe mommy or daddy do that, but you are scooping it up. So I want everybody to scoop. Can you guys scoop? Now I want you to think. There are two special sounds that have the sk sound. I'm only going to, I'm going to show you your two options and only one of them is right. And I'm not going to try and trick you. So the second one is not going to be the other one. So sk, which of these two special sounds says sk or scoop. Good. It's the S-C sk in scat that cat. Okay. Now, next one. I want you guys to act out slide. Can you guys pretend you are going down a slide? Whee! Sometimes this harper is a lot bigger than you guys, so I have to wiggle down the slide because I don't fit. Can you guys slide? Maybe you're sliding across the floor too. You don't have to go down an actual slide. Think which special sound is in that word? Which of these two? Good, it is the S L S L in sleep. Good job. Okay, next up. I want you guys to pretend you are going skiing. You are skiing skiing down a mountain, kind of like skating, except this time you are using your hands, your hands, your hands are like this, and ski, and ski. Are you guys having fun skiing? I hope so. Now I want you guys to think, excuse me, I've got you guys. What special sound is in the word sk? We've already used the S-C, sk, and scat. So think of what other one could it be? Which one of these two? Good, it is sk, s k, sk in skate. We used it for ski. Okay, we've got three more special sounds. We haven't done yet. This one, I want you guys to pretend to spill something. Oh no, and it made a huge mess. You were carrying a glass of milk and you tripped in it spill everywhere. Now remember, this is just pretend. Don't actually spill anything on purpose. Now, which of these two special sounds has the sp sound? Good, it is this one. This sp sp in spade. And we're digging a hole. Good job. We've got two left. Okay. Now, I want you guys to twist, 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 and then tell me which of these two special sounds is in the word twist. That is right. It is the T W T in twin. You guys are so very smart. And then our last one. I want you guys to pretend to snip off your hair. Pretend, pretend, pretend. Snip, 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 snip. I would make Miss Harper's hair really short. Now, don't use real scissors. You're using your finger scissors to pretend, okay? And which of these two special sounds do we hear in the word snip? Snip, snip, snip. Good. It is the S N sn in snuggle. Awesome. I hope you guys had fun playing that little activity. And now for your homework, what I want you to do is I want you to find uh, something in your house that you can use or think of something in your house or think of something that you can use for an action. And I want you guys to be ready to share that in our Zoom meeting. So we did snip. I talked about smile earlier, something in your house or something that you can think of that has one of our special sounds in it. And I want you guys to be ready to 
act it out, or if you actually have something that has one of those special sounds in it, use it as a prop to act out, okay? Now you can do one, or you can do any, any number bigger than that, okay? And find things, think long and hard. You can ask for help if there's something that mommy or daddy know. Remember, it's an action word, so it means you're actually gonna have to be doing something, okay? Now, ask for help if you need it. I'm here for help if mommy or daddy need to email me. Mrs. Troutman can help too, but I know you guys are so, so smart and you have brothers and sisters who are smart and mommy and daddies who are smart. I bet you guys can come up with at least one thing you guys can act out for us that has any of those special sounds in it, okay? I love you guys so much, and I hope you have a fantastic day, and I can't wait to see you guys in our Zoom meeting. I love y'all so much, and I can't wait to see you guys in math next week. Bye, boys and girls.